Hi friends, welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm going to share another healthy recipe which is a stir fry of Kaat Kobi. Kaat Kobi is also known as Kolrabi or White Vienna. Kolrabi or Kaat Kobi is rich in fiber, carotenoids, vitamin A, C, K and P. It is very good for health and we should include it in our daily diet. The recipe which I am going to show you is very simple and a very easy one. So let's quickly run through the ingredients to make Gaat Kobi stir fry at home. To start making Gaat Kobi stir fry, first of all we need to peel the Gaat Kobi. For this, here I have taken a peeler and a knife. First we need to cut the topmost portion, the crown portion of the Gaat Kobi like this. Now I have taken out the crown portion. Now take the peeler and start peeling the outer skin of the Gaat Kobi or Kalrabi. Now here I have peeled the outer skin of the Gaat Kobi and now I am going to cut into very thin slices. Now hold several thin slices of Gaat Kobi and cut it into vertical thin long slices like this. Now take a non-stick pan and add 2 tablespoons of vegetable oil. Once the oil will get heated up, I am going to add 1 teaspoon of mustard seeds to it. When the mustard seeds will crackle, then I am going to add 1 teaspoon of cumin seeds. Allow the cumin seeds to crackle. And then add finely sliced onion to it. Saute the onions till golden brown and then add a pinch of asafoetida or hing and then fry a bit. Now the onions have turned golden in color and I am going to add thinly sliced gaunt gobi or kolrabi to it. In dry spices I have taken 1 teaspoon of turmeric powder and 1 teaspoon of cumin powder. Now I am going to mix both of the dry spices with the gaunt gobi and mix them very well. Now here I am going to add 2 to 3 teaspoons of salt as per the taste to the mixture and give it a mix. Now give the lid for 3 to 4 minutes and allow the Gaant Kobi to become tender. One potato very thinly and kept it in water to avoid from blackening. Potato is optional. If you do not want to add, you can omit it. Now add the thinly sliced potato to the Gaant Kobi and give it a quick mix. Now give the lid and cook it for more 3 to 4 minutes. While we fry Gaant Kobi, it releases a large amount of water while frying. So we need to fry the Gaant Kobi till the point where the water dries from the Gaant Kobi. Mix the tomatoes and the Gaant Kobi very well and give the lid for 3 to 4 minutes. Now you can see that um, after the tomatoes and uh, the Gaan Gobi and the potato I have mixed everything very well and uh, the tomatoes have been mashed with uh, both of them and now I am going to garnish it with few cilantro leaves. The uh, cilantro leaves I have chopped very finely. Now 
mix everything very well here I have some frozen uh, green peas which I'm going to add in this if you have the fresh green peas you can also add the fresh ones give it a mix and then uh, give the lid for uh, two to three seconds now at this point of time please do not give the lid um, fry the gant kobi in open so that it will get a little bit crunchy at the bottom now my gant kobi stirred fry is ready to be served it's looking very tempting this dish is going to serve three to four members in a family this can be served with roti, naan, paratha and also as a side dish for rice and dal. Hope you all like this video and if you really like this video then please do not forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more such healthy recipes. Please try out this recipe at home and let me know how it turned out to be in the below comment section. Thanks for watching. I'll see you soon with another great recipe. Till then, take care. Bye.